get-rich-quick schemes have always had an allure about them. The thing about them, though, that I have found, and the thing that makes me very cautious, is that get-rich schemes nearly always benefit the one who proposes them a whole lot more than it benefits anyone who participates in them. Yeah, the classic pyramid scheme, it's the person at the top of the pyramid who draws from everyone below. So although their triangle might be the smallest, uh, their pocketbook is the thickest. You know, uh, get 12 people under you and let their money funnel through you to me. That's the usual framework. Well, Paul talks to the Ephesians about riches that are available to everyone, anytime. God has brought me to you, he says, to share with you this opportunity for wealth beyond anything you could imagine. The riches that Paul has to offer on behalf of God, faith, hope, love, grace, forgiveness, purpose. You know, there are things that no amount of money can purchase, but it's okay because although they're costly, they will not deplete your pocketbook at all. And they're available anytime, all the time, to anyone who will open their heart to God. So where are you? Have you tasted the riches that money cannot purchase, no amount of money can buy for you? Would you like to? Paul says, I would say, open your heart, humble yourself, and let God rain down riches upon you. It's why Paul was sent. It's why I have come. It's what God dreams to do for you. This is Ben Moore from West Highlands United Methodist Church with a thought for you today, just another way of reaching out. Thank you.